All right, I'm so glad to be here. Thank you, Marissa. Thank you, thank you, thank you for putting this all together. I really um, appreciate anyone who came here for this. Oh, a little wind is going to blow this away. Don't blow this way. I don't know if we have any clips. Ah. That's what I, this is what I get for not memorizing this yet. Yeah. We'll see if I can get this to work here. By the way, big uh, thank you to Richard Share for the signage tonight. It's awesome. Thank you so much for doing that. All right, we'll try this. So, big, um, pardon me? Oh, yeah, yeah. So I'm also here in Albuquerque, and um, this is one of the best secrets that this town is uh, really... Say doing. that! What you say? I didn't hear you. I'm sorry. This is one of the best kept secrets that Albuquerque is oh happening when it comes to poetry. I need you to say it one more time. I don't mean to be... Right. Albuquerque is a happening place for poetry. Do it! Right, and I'm really proud to be part of that, and I welcome all you guys that came from other places to be here, and I'm looking forward to tomorrow hear more of you. All right, so sometimes I play the drum when I do a poem. This one is called, Where You Stand. Come on. 
what should we regulate private citizens' lives? Are the independents the smartest of them all? Because they can take any stand they want to. Do we really need a government? Just ask the anarchists. Radical left and radical right fight it out in the streets. Violence, their only way to settle disputes. Are their causes worth you killing for? Are their causes worth you dying for? Is there just an incomprehensible, inevitable evil that keeps surging out in human beings when hate becomes a more efficient fuel for action than love? Where do you stand? Where you stand makes a difference in this world.